So then I'm like, well, I tried to sound, I tried to sound like, you know, like, <clears throat> like fake, like worried or something. Like not scared if you want to, like not really scared, trembling, like, like, hey, yeah, man. You're like, yeah, man, where you at, man? I mean, it's been fucking an hour. Or something. I'm like, no, no, I'm like, yo, man, the bushes, yo. I'm like, yo. So now they started to listen to me because they're on my tone. I'm like, hey, listen. I can't remember his name. I can't, I, I can't remember that cat name. My, my, my play. But uh, I said, listen to me, yo. I said, I had to just run out there. I told these niggas. <laughs> yo, I told these niggas I went in the crib, right? So I said, yo, I went in the crib right on the phone, right? I'm in my house, though. Right now, I'm in my house, like, basketball shorts on, blowing a blunt, like, the money sitting on the... <laughs> but I'm, I'm, in their mind, I'm, like, outside in the woods, hiding somewhere, you know what I'm saying? I said, man, when I went in the fucking house, man, to cop the shit, because I, I played it, like, I told them I didn't have the work, so I got to go. Or, man, if I, I might have told them I was just about to re-up or somewhere, y'all got to give me y'all money if y'all want to get straight, too. So that's why they gave me, and they knew me. So I tell him that I walked in the house. As soon as I come in the house, a big ass black nigga just grabbed me and nigga just put a chopper in my face, put me up against the door. You know what I'm saying? He's like, what? I'm like, yeah, man. It's like, man, I ain't know what to do. I'm cap as fuck, right? It's like, and, I, and I'm really playing the role. I'm sounding like it on the phone. Like, man, I ain't know what to do, bro. You know what I'm saying? They, they act like they said I was setting them up or something. And they ran my pockets, took the money, and da da da, right? So this dude is so square. And so he said, Oh, man, don't worry about it, man. As long as you're all right. He probably was more concerned about, like, if someone would get back to him. You know what I'm saying? Because he was, like, fake, like a realtor. Like, a lot of them plays I was selling crack to, that's what I'm trying to say, bro. You'd be surprised if people just type people that smoke crack, bro. It ain't just broke, busting, disgusted looking people, bro. I think I think bro was like a realtor, you know what I'm saying? If I'm not mistaken, or, or some shit like that, worked at a leasing office or some shit. That nigga smoking that yee, smoking that yola, that straight drop, and I had some drop. You hear me? Shit, nigga. Um, so that's how I beat them or whatever. So, of course, I never talked to them ever again, right? So uh, I was this dude I used to work with, right? So this was this was coming in like I did this like within the same week. So my other little partner, he had some fake heart. Like that nigga had some. I don't know who whipped this shit up. And but niggas in Atlanta, bro, are some of the most innovative. That's the first place. That's the first place I seen like a million dollars counterfeit money. And niggas was going crazy round the way with that shit, like. Nigga, that shit was an epidemic. But nigga has, nigga has, and it came, ironically, it came from the same nigga, right? Good shower remain nameless, but it, go, it come from the same nigga. Um, but through, I got it through from, I got it from my nigga because he got it from bro. Look, just like hard, um, uh, I mean, it looked just like hard, bro. It looked just like some hard, bro. I think it like, I don't know if it had an ore base in there. That shit make your chick numb. Only thing is when they smoke it, they'll, it'll turn green. Like it'll turn like, maybe like this color green. Like, uh, cause, cause old boy. So look, so this cat I used to work with, right? He was, he was younger than me. No, he was older than me. He was older than me. I try to, I, I, I used to work with this thing. So I, I put him on the list. I'm, he, he getting got for our lead too. Fuck him. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> I met him. I tried to sell him. We come to find out. He was like, you ain't got nothing else. This is why we at work. I'm like, what you mean? What else? What you mean? X pills or something? Or what you, powder? Oh, some hard. So, boom, come to find out he's a fucking crackhead, right? 25 years old, goes to college, don't even look like it. You would never think this kid was a crackhead, right? <laughs> this is fucked up. But it's true. It's true, though. So, um, so you know, it hit my idea. I'm like, shit, I'm about to leave. Ding! Let me get this nigga, too. And I had already been selling him, you know what I'm saying, hard. He ended up starting giving me mushrooms because my, 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 my crack was so fired. He was like, yo, man, just keep it coming, bro. And he would give me like an ounce of shrooms. I wasn't doing shrooms. I was like, that was some white boy shit. I wasn't fucking with that shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I Then I ended up learning how to sell shrooms. And I was like, oh, so it's, it's, it sells like this. Oh, okay. And I knew some people and da, da, da. But um, so I got him. So what it was with the fake hard, like whatever you, it's like a third of the price or something. Like an eight ball was like fifty dollars, and at that time you could probably get an eight ball for like one fifty if you really was plugged in one twenty five. If you really, really, really was plugged in a dollar, see, I can get them for a dollar from my nigga, but them niggas, you know how niggas be so inconsistent, you know. And then 
because sometimes you can just take another nigga money and go get it and then pocket the extra or whatever, the profit. But I said, fuck that. This nigga getting got. I told my nigga, let me get some of that shit. Boy, I got some of that shit. Couldn't wait for that nigga. Somebody called me. He called me. Sold that shit to him, right? Met him. Uh, he actually met me. He met me in some hotel room, but I was just finna leave. Like, after I was serving him, I was leaving out the room. I wasn't even going to be there to the next day or in fucking an hour if he did want to come back and knock on the door, right? Um, but I played it like this one I met, you know what I mean? Um, so I slang him the shit or whatever. This motherfucker called me back like, <laughs> dude, what the fuck? What the fuck was that, dude? I'm like, what's up, bro? What you mean, right? I'm up because I'm already knowing it's fake. My nigga already told me he was, he, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I already knew it was some motherfucking dummy. You know what I mean? It was straight dummy. So I don't, I don't know what them niggas made that shit out of, but it looked just like how I weighed. You could not fucking tell the difference unless probably you smoked the shit. Like I said, he said, man, when I lit it up, man, it, it was just turning green. <laughs> it's like, it was like lighting up green. I'm like, green. And then he's like, yeah, I think he might even send me a picture or some shit. Like, but it was like a green, like maybe like a green like this on Bob Marley's shirt, like a green, like fluorescent kind of like not really neon, but fluorescent. But um, I said, what? Right. Cap. I'm already knowing some. I know it's shaky. Well, I guess I said, man, look, man, I'm gonna call this nigga. I just got that shit from this nigga, man. Man, what the fuck, man? Hey, man, my back, this thing got me looking crazy. You know, I'm playing the whole, that's this shit crazy. Hey, look, I got you. I'm going to double you down on that shit, bro. I got to go, man, if I got to, I hope I don't have to shoot this nigga. He's like, no, nah, man, just take it easy, man. Just, I mean, I just want to let you know, man. I know you're not like that, man. I'm just, you know, just please don't, don't get yourself in more, you know, in no trouble. No, nah, man, this nigga playing with me, man. Hang the phone up, bust out laughing, right? I think I was there with my homie and shit, too. But, man, I, I, I ran them up, bro. It's too many fucking stories at the end of that rant, um. That I really like ran a fucking muck, my nigga. Like I ain't gonna lie, like I got all them niggas. By the end of, by by the end of me getting all my plays, my 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 crack plays, I had an extra goddamn six seven hundred dollars on top of the five hundred dollars I had. So I was I met my quote. I'm like I got twelve hundred. Time to go back to VA. You see what I'm saying? Got on the Greyhound. Got the fuck. Oh, did I catch the plane? I might have caught the fucking plane because it was a program back then where if you was like. Said you was in college, you can get like this was with Jet Blue. Was it Jet Blue? I think it was Jet Blue. I've been flying for a long time. I've been, I've been catching flights for a minute, right? Um, so this and this is like 12 years ago. This is old. This is throwback money, 12, 13 years ago, type shit. Um, but it was a it was a deal that if you said to him at the counter that you were a college student that you can fly back for like sixty dollars, seventy dollars. But it was it was blackout dates and you couldn't um you couldn't What's the word I'm looking for? I'm smoking weed. Um, you couldn't purchase it in advance. You know what I'm saying? Um, you couldn't reserve. You couldn't reserve. You had to co go to the airport the day you want to leave and be like, I'm in college. You, you, it was like a secret word you had to say. It was like JetBlue U or AirTran. Maybe it was AirTran. It was one of them cheap ass. It was like Spirit back then. But yeah, it came back to the R, bro. I ain't sold no damn crack since. You know what I'm saying? I just was like, nigga, I'm tired of selling crack, man. Fuck these niggas. I don't respect these niggas. These niggas smoking crack, nigga. I got shit to do. Got a family to feed. Got a family. I got to get back to the crib. Hey, it's been real. I wouldn't do that to my real niggas, but to some J's, I ain't going to fuck. Especially back then, nigga. I, was, I really didn't give a fuck about too much when I was young. I'm kind of more mature now, but... Yeah, man. I had to finesse them, bro. I had to. I, that was the only way I, I can get to that 1200 I need it. I can't. I can't. I, if I buy my ticket, that's gonna be fucking two hundred dollars or a hundred dollars or whatever type way. I, I can't remember. I caught a plane or caught a um a bus, but nigga, that's that. I'm, I get back to Virginia. I'm gonna have two hundred dollars. What I'm gonna do? I can't even re up on no weed. What the fuck? I'm gonna buy one ounce. Like, so I had to do it, man. Hey, that's what that's what times call desperate measures. What they say. I'm sorry. Uh, y'all, let me know what y'all think. Y'all ever had any kind of? Well, that's fucked up if y'all have this. <laughs> And I don't condone this, bro. Like I was, I, I don't, I'm not like that no more. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, I'm not even into that lifestyle no more. But I don't even play those games. Like, you know what I'm saying? Um, and you, my niggas are vouch for it. I never fucked over none of my niggas. But the Jays, they can get it. <laughs> y'all take what y'all think. Like, comment, subscribe, we'll go. Yeah.